China, should Canadian diplomats there or Canadians who are there actually should be worried uh, with what's going on with this ex-diplomat who was well, in prison? Well, we're, we're, we're obviously aware of the situation and we are deeply concerned by the situation. Uh, the uh, uh, Canadian uh, diplomatic officials have been in, in touch with uh, their Chinese counterparts to, uh, to explain uh, how seriously Canadians view this. Uh, and the deep concerns that we have, and consular officials uh, uh, have been in touch with the uh, with the family to uh, uh, to establish contact there and to try to offer uh, every kind of support that uh, that we can. Uh, but clearly, uh, we are we are deeply concerned, uh, and uh, Minister Freeland and her officials will be taking all appropriate action. Do we know if Mr. Colbert is, 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 okay? is okay? Do you have any status on how he is, where he is right now? At this stage, I can, I can make no comment on his status. Uh, our uh, officials from Global Affairs uh, are uh, doing their very best at this stage to make sure that, uh, that he is appropriately treated and taken care of. Uh, and when they have further information that they can release, uh, Minister Freeland will do that. You mentioned that you've been made aware of a situation. What is that situation? Can you tell us? Second of all, how were you made aware of it? Have there been contacts between Chinese officials and the Canadian government? And third of all, do you know what the allegations are uh, being uh, put we, forward? We, we, and when I say we, it's, it's, it's Global Affairs Canada and Minister Freeland. Uh, are uh, are obviously uh, working every one of those questions right now to yeah, make but you sure that. The situation. What's the situation, and how were you made aware of it? What we know is a uh, uh, a Canadian is obviously in uh, in difficulty in China. The further detail about exactly the nature of the situation, uh, I will have to defer to Global Affairs when they are in a position to offer more comment. They will. Uh, but they are, they are uh, sparing no effort now uh, to find out all of those answers and also to demonstrate to, uh, uh, to the Chinese government through our diplomatic offices uh, how seriously we view this matter. Are you concerned about any retaliation on the part of the Chinese authorities? Uh, uh, and it, we're obviously worried about whenever a Canadian uh, is put in a situation that uh, uh, puts them at some risk or jeopardy uh, where there's, uh, uh, there's uh, no uh, apparent or obvious cause or trigger for that. Uh, so before we characterize it, we want to make sure we get all the facts. But at the same time, we are sparing no effort to do everything we possibly can to look after his safety. He's in detention, he's in detention right? You can confirm he's in detention right now? I, I, look, I cannot comment on that until Global Affairs is in a position to confirm it publicly. Any Sorry? Any, any indication it could have something to do with the arrest of the Huawei executive in Vancouver 10 days ago? There is no explicit indication of that at this point.